What's up, YouTube? It's Toron here, bringing you a, a Diablo 3 beta let's play. I'm actually going to start off with a, uh, a wizard here. Let me turn down the sound a little bit, though. Actually, we want the effects. It's the music we want to turn down a little. All right. So yeah, I went ahead and created the uh, wizard named Toron, of course. And let's go ahead and start the game. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to break the uh, Let's Play into like 15 minute intervals. Uh, but, you know, for starters though, it's the gameplay has been this place reeks pretty sweet. Dead. The fallen star must be near. I love the voiceovers for this new one. It's just, it makes it so much more involved and so much more fun. And as you can see, the wizard, of course, casts spells. I'm currently casting Magic Missile. <coughs> Excuse me. And so far, it seems to run pretty smooth. Even with all the players doing the beta testing on it right now. So I've been pretty happy with the overall performance. I'm really excited for the 15th to come out. Prophecy sent me in search of the star that fell on this land. Prophecy. It fell on the old cathedral. There was only one survivor, Leah. You should speak with her. There's Just only the one survivor. Coming. We can't open the gates until we drive them back. Let's see if we can kill all these guys. Gotta love holding the shift and quick and fire. I've never seen anyone fight like that before. Of course not. Open You've never gates. seen Torhan fight. Leah at the slaughtered calf in. Now we get to go to the slaughtered calf. I came here to study the fall of old Tristram. This is closer to the town's history than I want to be. Benini. Zakarum has fallen to disgrace. What by the grace blessing. of the ancients? May your soul be warmed and brought to glory in righteousness. Ooh, we got a blessing. Found some interesting things on my latest dig. Ooh, you should take a pretty. Look. Of course, I can't buy anything just yet. Let's go ahead and go to the slaughtered calf in. That's the other cool thing is in this new one, you can go in the buildings, they can take you in the different places. Rumford said you survived the fallen star. I did, but it blasted my uncle Deckard Kane into the depths of the old cathedral. I tried to search for him. Deckard Kane. Rising. I came back here to rally the militia, but th watch out! The wounds are turning. I kill you dead. Use your daddy. I'm your daddy. My knowledge increases. This is killing business. Nice. Level two. And we get a new spell. Ray of Frost. All right. The dead will overwhelm us all unless something is done. I will make certain that doesn't happen. Your town is safe. Thank you. You should speak with Captain Rumford at the gate. He can tell you what to do. Captain Rumford. Let us be off. I promised Marco I'd protect him, but now he's dead. Sixteen militiamen went out. Only Rumford came back. I got eye on this. What can I do to help you fight the risen dead? I admire your courage, but Captain Dalton and the militia were slaughtered by those things. Only I survived. Thanks for the warning, but I won't be dying today. I'm a little bit tougher oh, than I you are. I've seen you fight. Strike at the wretched mothers and their queen. They're the ones vomiting out these horrors. They're attacking the barricades!
That ray of frost is pretty nice. That's one of the wretched mothers. There are more of them in the ruins down the road. You have new items. Ooh, I got better gloves than that. Let's wear these ones. Nice. I, Deckard Kane, have spent many years traveling and writing about the strange creatures in our world. But the sight of the wretched mothers still haunts me. They are the remnants of Queen Asilla's slaughtered handmaidens who were twisted by foul magic. Now they feast upon cadavers and regurgitate them as newly formed, risen dead. No touchy the door, hon. Yes, no attacky the door, hon. Knock back, that would be nice. So, so far, the gameplay is really nice. It's really smooth. Uh, the controls are easy. Um, you know, my wife, who doesn't really like to play MMOs, would play this because it's just easy. The controls aren't really complicated. It's, you know, hold down right-click to fire and hold down right-click to move, or left-click. Your attacks are either your left or right mouse click. which makes it really easy to, to navigate. And then of course you move by holding down the left click. So I mean the controls are really simple. I had heard the rumors, but I thought them just fancy. Makes it pretty women. easy to play. Until I saw them dragging people through the streets today. Our own citizens. Has the world gone mad? And I like the game, too, because it lets you focus more on the gameplay with the uh, narration and stuff in the background. You're not having to read everything. It just gives you a better overall feel for the game, I think. And the fact that the world is so... These little quill fiends can't be far from their nest. Die, suckers. That nest won't spawn any more of those vermin. That's it? I thought there'd be more of a challenge down here. Man, it was a waste of time. All right, back up we go. I mean, I guess the fact that is that we get experience, so it's not too much of a waste of time, but still. And of course, here's the map. Pretty nice. You can move it around with the left click. It tells you where you need to go. So yeah, I, overall, I'm really happy with the way they they've done. Uh... Oh wow. Bad wretched mother. I'm really happy with the way they've improved the game. And I will be playing this for a while when it comes out. Right, let's keep the wand in there. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to the 15th when it comes out. I think it's going to be a blast. Um, 
what I'm going to try to play this till I can max out my character. I think it's 13 is the highest you can go in the beta right now. Uh, but I, I want to actually try out a couple other classes as well. So I'm going to be playing this class until we hit the max level. And then I will be switching to probably the monk next, I think. The monk seems like it might be a fun class. Of course, there's always the, the big brutal barbarian. And the witch doctor seems like it might be pretty fun too. But I, uh, I wanted to try out this wizard class and see how it plays first. So that's why we're a wizard. All right, we gotta go up to where the uh, wretched mothers are. So basically, this this first video is just gonna be us completing these first couple quests, and then we're gonna move on and do some more. But so far, I really like it. It's been really fun. I remember I actually still play Diablo 2 every now and then, and I can sit down and play that game for a while. So I'm really looking forward to this one. I think it's going to be nice. My old Woo! masters could see me now. Level three. And now we have Shock Pulse available. Aha. Shock pulse, huh? Need more time. Oop, another journal. I returned to Condoras after twenty years. The burden of countless failures and tragedies heaped upon my shoulders. Am I being punished for helping that stranger hunt the dark wanderer? I always thought Deckard Cain have a madman. Perhaps he was right. Perhaps he can banish the shadow hanging over my life. Wow, that electricity shock is pretty good. Nice. I like it. While exploring a cave with hopes of finding hidden treasure, I came upon a most grisly sight. A heap of dead bodies. Unbelievably, as I was searching them for any items of value, they began to rise. I must tell them of this and new Tristram before it's too late. I like it because it's a uh, AoE spell, basically. To put an end to the attacks, at least for now. Nice. We took care of the wretched mother. Let's see what's down here. Where's all the yeah. treasure? The fiends didn't take it, did they? I want treasure. And I like that you can just walk over gold and pick it up nowadays. You don't have to, like, click on it individually to pick it up anymore. Ooh, I picked up a magic item. Let's see what it is. It's a bow. I don't really think we use bows as a wizard. But I think you can share your stash now. Which means that we can actually save that for, um, for a uh, a demon hunter when we make one. So that's pretty cool. Another wretched mother to kill. Too easy. And we hit a checkpoint. Go us. Old Tristram, Diablo himself once walked this place. I got one behind me.
Need more arcane power. Well, it looks like I completed that quest. Very nice, very nice. I really like this spell. It is awesome. Yeah, I can't wait till we can unlock some of the other spells I've seen in like the other people's Let's Plays with this. Some of the wizard spells that they had available were pretty freaking sweet. I'm not gonna lie. I think they have like a time stop spell almost where you can you can stop people in the tracks, fire stuff, and kill them before they can hurt you. Don't attack me, you jerk! It's not nice to touch me. Oops, you die. I don't need friggin' bows, people. I need a new wand. Oh well. Take the waypoint back. And let's turn in our quest. Thank you for your help. But could you talk some sense into Leah? She won't give up on the idea of rescuing her. She thinks her I want to talk sense into her. She. I will help her find him. Yeah, see, sucker, ha. Huh. Come, let us search for your uncle. We'll need to open the cathedral first. The guards locked it up before they were ambushed. Rumford told me they fought their way back to Adria's hut. The key must still be there. Adria's hut? Alright. Let's go sell this crap we don't need. I've got some bread. Right. A right good bunch of things don't for you, you this fine day. Don't need you. I'll keep you. Actually, I think we can disenchant these, essentially, for materials for building our own other weapons. So we'll keep it for that purpose. And we have a whole 1,025 gold now. Nice. So, so far, so good. Let's see how big our stash is. That's tiny. Oh, wow. To get 14 more slots, it's 10,000 gold. That's insane, you guys. I guess it would be worth it to buy out your chest eventually. Still, though, that's insane. Alright, um, before we take on this next quest, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. We'll, we'll start the next quest off for the next video. Um, but thanks everybody for watching. I hope you're enjoying this Diablo 3 beta. And the, uh, the Diablo 3 is right on the corner, everybody. The 15th of May. So get excited. I'm, I know I am. But anyways, you guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.